Hey guys, this is Garis. Welcome back to my gaming channel. We are here in a new series. I'm going to try it. This will be a quick mod spotlight explanation type of thingy. Um, not really a mod spotlight, just the basics of how things will work. I've got a few questions with players online and one of my regular viewers. So I thought let, this is a good opportunity to focus on one specific thing in just a couple of minutes so this won't be a long dragged out thing it won't be crafting it will just be showing you how things operate might be a bit of crafting here and there <clears throat> excuse me and this might be the longest episode because of a little bit of explanation at the beginning okay so today's episode is about drawers um, my system i'll just show you how it looks is looking like this I have Ender IO conduits behind each drawer and each chest. Okay, so people have asked me um, why I do it that way because drawers have its own system. I know, but I prefer it this way um, because I, th for me, it feels like I have more control over what happens. So um, let me just show you how my my system works in case you don't watch my series and know how that works so obviously if i take everything so there's now zero items there's zero items there there's two stacks of wood now there's only one one and no coal so i just dump everything in here and i put the ender io conduit as extract always on and it will filter it here and you will see the items gets increased okay nothing there yet i don't have any speed upgrades there so there's nothing on ender io this is on draw so we're not going to handle upgrades now so um, i think wood is next then that and then that so we have everything back in a drawer okay so there's a different way of handling this so you can do this and you can make yourself one of these drawer controllers so this is all the items that there is there's your basic drawers in your, all your different wood types then there's the basic drawers one by two so it has two drawers one at the top one at the bottom also in the different wood types and then one by, or two by two drawers so it has four drawers also different wood types and then the half block it's basically more like a cupboard on the top same thing then you get the trims we'll handle that as well we have trims i'm just using basic oak you can it works the same with everything okay and then upgrades it's kind of self-explanatory i just want to talk about the basic mechanics of this so this is all the drawers it's all the same drawers it's just different type of wood and trims and so on so here's the trims so basically you can only what look from here to here to this packing tape i should have made a packing tape as well okay just that <laughs> okay um so we the packing tape is awesome like now you see there's seven items in this drawer so you use a packing tape you tape it and you can then pick it up and you can move this away unfortunately there's no way to see what's inside it it says content sealed within so if you move it make sure you know what is in when you move it and then you place it and the items will still be in there let me show you what happens on one that does not have packing tape tape on it you get the items and the drawer back so which isn't the issue so oops that's trim let me take a trim so now it's a blank drawer basically and you can save items back into it okay and you get this key it's really cheap key to some gold and you use it on everything so you right click and it locks the drawer okay but we'll get to that so let's just quickly do this so that i can put this back okay see it's locked again okay so as i was saying there's a different thing you can do you can use this control drawer controller again with this you plug it in there and this operates that so we're not going to extract only going to insert 
So this one controller can handle all the drawers. Okay, so I could have used this in place of all the conduits. So let me show you how it works. Okay, so there's no um, no uh, emeralds, no diamonds, and no coal. But there's still some of these items. So now I'm going to put this in. Give it a few seconds, and it will start appearing here. So this controls it, as the name says, drawer controller. And you can put a filter in here and filter what goes into this stack. So, but now, um, oh, let me show you what happens if something was not locked. Okay, let's take off these locks. So, now I want diamonds at the top. Um, this will work with most items. So let's, or if it's more than two items, because then it gets quite confusing. So let's say, okay, there's now emeralds there. If I take out everything, it's gone. But if I lock it and I take out everything, it still says emeralds. So if I unlock it, now if I put in diamonds and emeralds, now it will go randomly. So, well, luckily, <laughs> it is in a correct order. So, but let's say, okay, that one is still locked. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, so now, let's see. See, now it's in a different order. So that's why you lock the drawers. Also, you can right click on a controller itself. Come on. Okay, you have to right click on the face of a controller and it will lock all the drawers. Okay, so now the issue, not an issue, but if you want to, like my system, it's now split because I like it to be grouped. So you can split the system as well. What you do, grab a shovel quick. So underground, you can basically dig out a channel, you can take your wood trims. This is technically, if you want to look at it like that, it's the cabling for drawers. So now you can take your drawers, you can put it up, can lock it you can put in diamonds and emeralds take it out now there's nothing in well, let's do this let's unlock it and then take it so now if we put in emeralds and diamonds it will link it so this controller will link to that but now the problem comes in how do we join this chest let's say I want to have dirt in this chest or let's say a combination of glass and dirt how do I monitor send it to there there's no way that this system will be able to handle it and that is why I do it like that I think it's more neat and I can do the filtering especially on priority on the Indra IO conduits etc with filtering and putting priority so that one is still empty so that's why there's no insert let's get something that has inserted this is two items so i have on the filter i have two items and i have priority set so i just want to say on a con uh, actually we shouldn't talk about ender io so this was a mini feed the beast mini on drawers i hope you guys enjoyed it Please consider subscribing to my channel and I will see you guys in the next mini. Cheers!